Hello everybody and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Hearts of Iron 3. Last episode we made a little bit more progress in India. Uh, over here we made a little we made some more landings down here with some uh, some of our elite troops and uh, I neglected to take any look at Germany and it looks like the the front's holding relatively strong. It's kind of fluctuating back and forth here and there a little bit, but I feel like I I, I desperately want to open up a front with the German with the Soviets down here. And help them out. So, with that in mind, any troops that I can... Let's see, who, who... Where do I have troops available that I can pull? Um, not you guys. Why, why are you not attached to anybody? You should be attached to the same guy that's operating these guys. So this is, uh, the... Second Corps. And you should be helping out over here, so let's get you up there. Let's help out. Let's help out. Alrighty, now, I really want these troops over here. <laughs> I really want these guys to, uh, to help out, but why don't we do that? Why don't we wait till Hong Kong falls here? Uh, let's do, let's do this. Let's grab, grab these guys. And let's rebase them right over here. And we're going to grab, let's see, what, well, well, these guys right here. Nope, 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 nope. Um, ah, here we go. Uh, load you guys up. Th these transport ships are going to be doing a little bit of work for me, so we're going to rebase over here. There we go. I know exactly where some of this stuff is going and not exactly where some of it is going. I'm wondering if these tanks would be good at fight. Tanks are good in the desert. Tower has been lost. Yeah, I know. It was an uprising. Rodney has been lost. That was a little belated. Tarwa has been lost, but it's not a big deal. Uh, no, we're not going to form another another army that's unnecessary. The Marines can take care of that in a moment. Um, let's see, you attack that guy there, thank you. Move up this way. Alright, not bad. The monsoons are really slowing everything down. Hate the monsoons. But it does make sense. I'm glad that that kind of stuff is in the game. B2s. I'm gonna keep building those because they're not that expensive, and I'm, I know they'll be useful eventually. I just don't know exactly when. All right, so these guys are ranging around down this way. You guys are ranging around over this way. You know what? Let's um just keep you. Let me move these guys up here and help uh, fight these British troops. Where's the? All right, so this port probably one of these guys down here closest port I have to where I want to be. So you should probably stay here. Or two there. You can keep going this way. I cut off their ports. They're not going to have any Pacific Conqueror. Ooh, National Manpower Modifier. I see. Send change down. National Unity up. Oh, you know what? It was uh, from losing Tarawa. It actually was down from where it was before. Alright, no big deal. Alright, so you're heading this way to grab another port, but the British are trying to move over here. You know what I should do? Where are my... I, I don't even know. I, I've completely lost track of where a lot of stuff is. Can you attack these guys over here and actually do something? I wonder if they're fighting low on supplies. Lack of supplies, yeah. Can we bomb? How are you guys doing? Eh, you're not doing great. Ground attack. Actually, you know what would help? Move order. That. Like, ships. I don't remember where I put a lot of my ships. Did I... Did I put these guys over here for a reason? Can They, they can't reach that far. No. That's a shame. I wish they had the range for that. No point in having these guys o all the way over there. Just sucking up supplies that I don't need to absorb that way. When they said I had amphibious tanks in the comments, I, was, I have no idea what they're talking about. I was like, I don't think I have amphibious tanks. Mountain unit training, very nice for me. Lo we, oh, we, I thought that said we lost the Battle of Hong Kong. Hong Kong's been won. So our ships, they, they, we should drive out their ships and catch them here. As soon as our, our troops get in there. 
Who's gonna get in there first? I imagine you guys would be the fastest right now. April 6th. Oh, we won that battle. Nice. Oh, you know what? I bet the, the ships arrived and the shore bombardment really did them in, I bet. So we're gonna keep crawling around the coast here with these light troops. They're doing pretty well. You know, ooh, I just thought of something we could do. Plus, like, we could strategically bomb the hell out of Australia if we really want to. Alright, you... Cancel that attack, but you'll pick it up. Installation security advances. What did we finish building? Some, uh, some spare, uh, carrier air groups. You know, let's, um, put this on prioritize upgrades for now. This should take care of everything by itself pretty easily that way. Alrighty, so... We're still patrolling with our carriers out here. The British fleet hasn't been spotted in a long time. Why don't we... Can you make it out this way? We can make it out this way. Why don't we patrol over here? See if there's anything going on. I don't have a lot of troops in, in, in this southern pocket down here, but the ones that are there are great. Ah, oh, under attack. That sucks. Well, we're about to break them, so I'm not too worried about that. I need to take that port and link up these these fronts here. Even the smallest bit of supplies coming through there is going to help. Alrighty, so do we arrive with our ships? We did. And, and everybody actually did get knocked off here. So we're going to grab these guys and we're going to merge them together with these guys. Like this. Give them at least a little bit of combined arms. And make them more combat effective. And I was actually going to use these guys to a uh, pretty good pretty good effect. Let's see. This one. Merge. Alright, now is that all of them? Let's see, no. Uh, no. So this one. The it oh, starts with an eight. This one. Needs a thingy. Merge. Alright. Now uh, let's see here. Make sure they all have them. Infantry. Oh, every, everybody got unloaded, didn't they? Yeah, a bunch of these guys got unloaded. But we, what we could do is we could grab, um, is it five home gun? Yep, all these, um, cavalry units, which are going to be pretty useful. There's no possible fleet to load these onto, really? They're not that heavy. I had tanks on there before. 49. Oh, this guy's got two of them by accident. Well, let's see what we can. It's just, it's not that much. Come on, guys. Load. Garrison, garrison, garrison. Alright, well, I wanted you. Well, let's, um... Grab what we had, at least. I want to move a lot of these guys around. Unload, unload from fleet. He's already on the fleet. Right. So we got some of the cavalry here. I'm confusing myself with this now. You know, you know, you know. Well, these guys have been to move around eventually. Oh, okay. We got everybody we w really wanted right now. I guess I made too many of those. I thought there was more. Oh well. So you guys, I know exactly what I want to do with you. We're going to transport you over here. For now. And they're going to help out uh, help out down here. And then they're going to be part of this invasion up this way. Alright. trying Just trying to get these things a little sorted out. A little bit better. A little sorted out. A little bit more... A little bit more organized here and there. So we're attacking... This way? Thought I had another division there. I guess I didn't. Alright, everybody. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, so let's see. Oh, you know what? These guys must be the ones that came out of Singapore here. So it is two battleships, a couple, two heavy cruisers, two light cruisers, and two destroyers. They've got heavy cruisers. 
and a bunch of smaller stuff. I don't know. Well, that's all I have nearby. So let's see how this turns out. Let's watch the combat here. Everybody's. Oh, everybody. The whole fleet's in action now. Looks like they're getting hammered pretty badly, though. We're going to see if we can actually chase them down when this is over. We're outnumbered, but that doesn't matter. We got the big guns. Firing on the Sussex. Hitting the Sussex. Minor damage. Alright, so they're moving down this way, so we're going to move down this way and see if we can chase them. I mean, these guys are not slow. 23 and a half kilometers an hour. We should be able to chase them down pretty simply, I would imagine. I'm really hoping we can catch them right here, because that's exactly where they were going. Ah, oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Parcel pass, so we're chasing them down again. Battle of the big guns. Looks like the Sussex went down. Looks like we got us a Dutch ship in there, too. So they lost the Sussex. Which way do you think they're going? It doesn't... Sh it's not showing me. I'd imagine they'd be going this way, though. Let's see if we can chase them down. I want you... Are per perfectly fine to go right here. That actually freed up some troops. I'm imagining this is where they're going, but I, I, I don't actually know. I'm just taking a wild guess, because it could have been in any direction. But I'm hoping. Up. Oh. Caught him again. Big guns are in action. What we should actually do is before before we let this get out of hand, they attacked me up here and then canceled their attack. So now we're heading down this way. Moving super slow. Well, I've, I, I'm working on, you know, having all these guys capture all this land. Is it really necessary to capture everything? I don't know, it might be. It'll make me feel good at least. But right now I have troops coming in that'll help with that. Boom, hit them. Who, who's over here? I don't even know. Alright, well we know where they're going, they're going this way. I don't know what naval combat that is. So they lost two heavy cruisers, or two light cruisers and a liner. We're going to chase them back up this way. Ah! They lost a battleship, the How, And we are going to definitely chase them that way, see if we can catch them. We patrolled over here. I wonder if we could, we could find them a little better. What do you, what do, you do? Where are you going? Back. Infantry unit training, infantry unit command and control. Well, whoa, whoa, again, again, okay, okay. All right, patrol here. Found them again. I really want to sink those transports. I don't know if there's anybody on them, but I want to sink them. Although the, the convoy raiders got involved. A heavy, their heavy cruiser and the other ocean liners down. All right, so now let's get you in here. And where are you guys? Oh, hey, you guys are coming down to India. All right, so let's see if we can work on this garrison here. I mean, it's a garrison unit, but you know, what? I was about to say we don't exactly have good situ a good positioning here. I don't know who we're fighting here. Again, it just says nothing. It just shows nobody's there, but we can try. We sank. Oh, we sank the. Hemerier? The hell ship was that? Yeah, move over here so we can find them again. I don't know who we're finding. It's a, it definitely seems like uh, some British battleships, though. That have been moving around down here. Well, they were there, at least. Alright, if we just kept it up, do you think we could beat them? You know... Losses be damned. Do you think we could beat them? Right, what do we finish? Uh, so these are smaller gear. So, so th these are guys I'm making to um, take places of other other units and to properly garrison some places. There's like, you know, like, what's it called? Um, Tarawa. We lost Tarawa. Because there was nobody there to defend it, basically. All 
Alright, so... Supply production, seaport capabilities, nice. Now, who do we got? Wow, I forgot all these guys are... I, I just... I, it always... Baffles my mind that I leave all these guys sitting around and then completely forget about them. So, these guys are getting the battle commanders that I've completely been neglecting. Oop! Um, you guys, unload. Nope, not load. Unload. So it was this guy and this one. Uh, merge. I'm like, who, do, who, who are all these divisions? So th this entire core here. I can load them up. And then you are not even attached to anybody. Let's load you up. There's all these infantry divisions. Not even attached to anybody. I'll load you up. Get these guys a little organized. Get these guys out of here. Let's load them all up. Sucking up supplies. So that leaves just this guy here, which is good. That's exactly what we want. So, actually, these are loaded up in both in both fleets here. So let's. Where should we go with these guys? Well. Huh. I'm just trying to trying to get my head around what I'm doing here. Confusing the bejesus out of myself. Let's just take everybody here for now. We'll bring them back to the mainland. We base here. That way we're not shipping supplies to them. Just trying to get get ourselves organized. Alright, these guys are just about where they need to be. Come on. There you go. Let's load you up. These guys, you know what, we'll, we'll figure out what to do with them later. I want these light guys... Um, down, working down here for me. Yeah, let's do this. Now we can't get that. That's too far away, clearly. For now, let's just drop them off right over here. We need. We really need to take all this Indian land. Which is not proving terribly difficult. I mean, they're, they're, the British are beaten pretty bad. I mean, we wiped out their army that was over here. Really wiped him out. I don't have you guys set to do anything. Let's fix that. Or what's more important, assisting in this, you know what? What's more important is taking this port. That's what's more important. You go there and then swing around and hit these guys here. Oh, they're about to, ah, oh, damn it. Now we got more troops coming in here. We got more troops coming in. It's fine. Not worried about that. Alright, so. Looks like we can pretty easily move around here. Hedgehog defense. Nice. Pretty easily jump around different islands, it looks like. I'm, I'm happy with that. All these troops moving around. Got like some, some free infantry divisions here that don't have anything to do now. We can, uh, uh, you know, make a, fill up a core and, and do something with them. Plenty of troops, honestly. Uh, let's see. Ooh, who can help here? We can... We can sl try to slow them down by launching an attack with two understrength divisions. And then supporting attack from this direction and support attack from this direction. And... Yeah, that'll do the trick. That'll, that'll, that'll break out there. That'll, that'll break that little stalemate they got. Moving fast or moving slow? Move in medium. Don't just don't have enough troops down here is the thing. This guy's wearing themselves out. Pretty much. Probably be the best idea would be to I don't know, let's see. Uh leave you there. Oh, they're gonna attack me now? Okay. Go for it. It's fine by me. Alright, let's go take a look at the Philippines. So you're gonna go up this way, you're gonna go over this way. Thank ya. Yeah, the Philippines have proven 
mighty easy, actually. Uh, I am not terribly worried about bombing a Manila. Not ter terribly worried about what's been going on. Ooh, I got an idea. Dun, dun, dun. Looks like these guys actually got into some combat. But uh, it looks like I keep getting bombed in Manila. So let, let's go. Let's rebase them to Clark Field here, not in Manila, but nearby. Or did they actually get there? No, they actually got to Manila. So we're just going to air intercept anybody, then range here and see if they get into some combat. Because they seem to like bombing my ports there. Nav tactics, nice. Now, do we have... Okay, so it's the first new batch of units is coming into India pretty soon. These guys are flopping around, doing their thing down here. Have everybody meet up down at this port. Gotta get some garrisons down here. Who's this? Ah! I got so many troops moving around, I'm losing track of who's where. Alright, we got a port. Nice. Now the next thing is to, to link up these fronts, and let's see, level one? No, it's a level six! Wow. Man, I took the wrong port, didn't I? Link these guys up, and we'll be good to go. Nice, not bad. Level six port, would you look at that? So we're gonna take this one, and then we're gonna hit this British division here. You guys are just sitting there. Um... We're kind of running out. We don't, we don't have enough troops here. Seaports, level 7. Seaports are extremely important to me. Money and resources. Resources. Money, meh. Resources, yes. Desperate, desperately need resources. Uh, so, well, let's, uh, let's change our mind about what's going on down here. Let's grab... These guys could at least uh, transport down here. Help take out this British little dude. I'm looking forward to getting my tanks into action over here, and all these cavalry units should be pretty good. I mean, this is a lot of planes, and I haven't had a chance to actually use my tanks appropriately. Philippines are getting gobbled up. Yeah, we're just basically going to keep pushing them north and squeezing them out. They're running low on resources and... Uh, zero? Are you kidding me? No, it's got to be a lot better than zero. Yeah, that, that, that's that got to be better than zero. We got to be winning that. Yeah. All right, so do we make it... Ah, there we go. All right, now. Tanks. You guys are going to oh we're gonna we're gonna fight some we're gonna fight tanks with tanks is what we're gonna do. Um now let's see the cavalry. Let's actually yeah, let's grab all these cavalry guys and send them up here. The infantry send over this way. Light infantry will send over this way a little bit further. Good. Now we have some troops down here. Didn't I tell you guys to transport down that way? This is this is a situation where I wish it was easier to place units. Man, I really wish it was easier to place units. Wish you could actually place units on your you know in your area that you've conquered anywhere you want, basically. But that's not exactly how it works. See, our tanks should be pretty zippy. Yeah, seven kilometers an hour. Weather is not really affecting them too badly. British actually brought in more troops than I expected down here, but, you know, it's still pretty spread out and whatnot. Uh, let's see if we could trap their tanks in the city here. What I'm hoping is that they're just going to be really shitty at fighting there. I mean, we don't have, a, you know, great guys there, but we do have guys there. Keep them bogged down for now. Alright, nice. Got into some combat, finally. Night modifier. Well, when night ends, we should, should be doing a lot better. There we go. There we go. Nice. 
Well, we got all these troops here now. Um, rebase right there, please. Thank you. Might actually just... Yeah, they'll probably help help out down here. And then they're gonna bunny hop their way. Maybe Oman and then into Iraq. And I, I, gotta, I gotta help them as quickly as I can. And that's the way it's gonna happen. That's the way it's going to work. Where, 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 can you just go up here and take that guy out? He's just running around, causing, being mischievous. Who do I got sitting here now? Alright, I know exactly what these guys are, are there for. Okay, good. Philippines, not worried about that. Alright. Now, you should be able to have no problem going over this way. Yep, you're going to go down there and take that guy out. You're going to capture that for me. Marines have gotten... What, what's nice about, been nice about this is the Marines are getting a lot of good experience out of this, and especially for their amphibious tanks. Their amphibious tanks are getting some good combat experience. And I do not know... If the, the Philippines is technically an independent state, so it should fall on its own, right? Let's look at VPs. Well, there's a bunch of VPs to deal with, so. I can't believe this is a level 6 port. I did not expect that. So you need to do the... Oh, damn it! I gotta stop doing that. It was almost finished with this movement, and then I told him to go over this way. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Should not have done that. So let's do, 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 is it, I think it's two home gun. You're gonna load up. I'm gonna drop you right here. Well, we're gonna rebase these guys down here, and you're gonna help over here. I basically want to take these islands to deny them uses, uh, uh, use by the British. Ooh, naval base efficiency up. Because if uh, the British can't use them as, as, as bases, then I don't have to worry about their troops coming from those, their ships more. That's what I'm, I'm not afraid of the British troops, but the British ships. God damn it. That doomstack pain in my butt. British doomstack of doom. Alright, so you're just kind of hanging out here, so let me send you back to Hong Kong to hang out. Pretty stagnant up here, but I, I'm kind of hesitant to, to make a move before these guys get their organization, like all of them get their organization. Intelligence Network. Um, so less money, but espionage bonus, or gains neutrality. Money is not, money is like, I don't feel like money's too, too terribly useful. I'll take the intelligence bo bonus. I'm not really doing much on intelligence right now. Uh, it, it, in, I think if I could, re if I was to redo it, probably would be a little bit more important to me. But not right now. You guys turn that way. What are they getting? A terrain bonus? Territorial pride. Oh, they're getting a pretty big territorial pride bonus over here. Let's see if we can get these guys going. Eh, I gotta have trouble crossing that river there. So this guy's one of his divisions is with him. Oh, you know what? There's a river crossing there, too. Alright, so... Now let's have these guys help out by... Going two of them over here. Well, we're gonna get over there, and then we're gonna move. We're gonna move on them. Alrighty, alrighty. A little bit of progress on all fronts. And what's important to me is taking... Taking bases in India to use as a staging ground to try to help out. And the British definitely seem like they're um, a little more interested in India now. Now that I've got uh, a bit of a foothold here. Which, this it could be a, a big fight, bigger fight for India than I anticipated, but I'm fine with that. They want, If they want to they throw down for India, I will throw down for India. That's perfectly fine. Looks like most of the troops in the Philippines have been wiped out. Damn it. The game just crashed on me. Um...
that's really unfortunate because we were seconds away from ending this episode. So uh, I guess I'm going to have to replay from back up to basically the end of April, but that's not a huge deal. We'll just replay. I- I'm just going to have to replay off screen back up to uh, about April 25th. And um, damn it. I should I should have ended it exactly 30 minutes and we wouldn't have run into this problem. But anyway, if you've enjoyed this, just drop me a like. Leave me those comments right down below. And if you're interested in more Benjamin Magnus Plays Hearts of Iron 3, just subscribe to this channel and I'll see you next time.